radical. You can drive, you could go back, you could drive it in like the 1920s. Really? Yes. That's pretty cool. Same with the Vito's, Vito's Corvette, the red and white Corvette. Yeah. That you can play that in Mafia 1. Dang. It's interchangeable. Yeah, yeah. Um, Tommy's Taxi, you could drive in the other two games. Tommy's Taxi? Yes. Now, uh, how was the Definitive Edition? Was it pretty good? It was good. Did you get around it to playing it? It was really good. They improved upon the engine of this game. Yeah, I know this was a legendary edition. So you, you know you know how the damage is when you damage the cars on there, right? Mm-hmm. It's, does, um, does it not damage them that well, or...? It doesn't damage them too too well. Yeah, yeah. It deforms them, but the, uh, the headlight covers usually stay. Yeah, yeah. Until you do severe damage. Oh. Whenever you damage the car in Mafia 1 re- or Definitive Edition, the headlight covers break right away. Right away? Yes. So that's a little bit of a difference. Yes. The damage is so much more realistic. When it comes to the open world car type games, what's your favorite of all time? Forza Horizon. I think me, I like San Andreas. San- oh, so GTA you're San talking Andreas. about like... A car like cop type games you're like where you're getting in and out of cars and stuff and yeah you know be, beat people up, up. Yeah, yeah, like yeah this is pretty good see definitive I mean, editions oh no i heard it's they, i mean i've seen it's bad they've gotten did they fix it any better really but the launch was just ugh. launch was terrible it was terrible well, that's the problem with these like launches you know sometimes they launch a game and it's just not ready like it is just not ready, and they don't care, and they'll patch it and fix it later, you know? Yeah. Yeah, so those are actually Super Mario DVDs from the Super Show. The Mario Super Show. <laughs> and it's kind of funny, you know? Then they do a uh, live action version with. Uh, it was the, uh, the person, was... John Leguizamo, who was. Uh, no, no, no. I'm talking about uh, before them two. Before? It, it was like... In the 90s. There was an episode of it where they collabed with... Oh! Uh, Lou Albano. Inspector Captain Lou Gadget. Albano. Inspector Gadget. I know there was a wrestler. Captain Lou Albano. Oh, he was part of it. Okay. Yeah, I don't there have was, a lot of knowledge of that. There was an episode, a live action episode, where uh, they meet Inspector Gadget. Oh, really? Yeah. They meet Inspector Gadget. Yeah, Inspector Gadget comes to them to for help to repair yeah, yeah. him. Interesting. The, the plumbing in him, kind of. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that right there, you can do that for seven. I have nine on it, but probably I could go for seven. Very nice socks. But it's it's a very obscure episode. Oh, I can imagine. Very obscure. But it's nice uh, seeing you, man. Yeah. You know, take a look around. I got stuff over here too. You know, that three dollars. If you like comics or magazines, I got a lot of comics and magazines on the bottom there. I don't have the space for them. Oh, you don't have the space? I live in a very, I, I live in a trailer house. So it's very small. And I have the small room. Oh, so it's not a lot of room to actually uh, yeah. really do much anything with. Yeah. Yeah. I've basically been, uh, for like the uh, DVDs and games and stuff, mm-hmm. I take them out of the case and put them in my, into my uh, sleeve binder. Yeah, yeah. And then I put the, uh, the cases in a safe part of my closet. Oh, okay. Storage. Yeah, yeah. I tried to get into Futurama. It's, it's not for everybody, man. You know, like some people really like it. Some people are like, it's brilliant. Some people, you know, not really into it. Of the collections I got, you, you know anything speaking about of, wrestling? Speaking of Rey Mysterio. Yeah. WWE 2K22 is really good in every room. Like the, uh, so it's good. The, 2K20 uh, wasn't that good. The showcase revolves around May, Rey's career. Is it like, did they fix it? Did they actually fix oh, it? It's, it's 10 times, it's 20 times better, better than the other one. 20. Oh, now is that is that DLC or like does it come with a no, $60 the game? No, showcase it revolves around its history. Game. It does have Eddie Guerrero in it, does it have some of his it, matches. It, 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 it revolves around his career. How you doing? 
Uh, it's all fair. Start, start, yeah. It starts you, with the showcase. You start with his very first ma big match yeah, yeah. against him and Eddie Guerrero at the uh, that Halloween Havoc. Halloween, Halloween Havoc. Havoc. He was he was in that purple cut purple outfit yeah. against Eddie Guerrero. I, I love Ray. I've always loved Ray. You know, I just didn't want to part with that one, but uh, you know, I'm just trying to like make room for the house, get rid of some stuff. Some things I just like come across in acquiring boxes. Like I got South Park season four and one. Definitely, I think this one will move because it's like that's the first season of South Park. Yes, yeah, it's season six here. That's the one with uh, uh, Lemmy Winks. You, you follow, have you watched any South Park? I've played the game. Oh, South the, sti the stick of truth. I, I, the I got the stick of truth on 360 in this box. I got to get ready. Uh, it's it's just awesome to go around that world, isn't it? And it, then people actually like um, like Al Gore and some other people in the corners in the bushes will talk to you. I for the longest time I had gotten stuck at this one part of the game. Yeah, yeah. In the uh, the uh, clinic. In the what? In that clinic mm -hmm. where you had to give uh, the thing to uh, Randy. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think I remember that part. Yeah. And I kept... My game was... I figured out that my game had glitched. Yeah, yeah. And the control... The button prompts weren't popping up. And... Uh, right. And it just... Didn't after, work. After a while, I'm like... I gotta go back and play it, and I started a fresh new save, and I finally beat it. it it's still fun to play, you know. Yeah, I, I like uh, being That's able to. Game I've been wanting to play. Stunt animation. animation. Yeah. Well, if you have an Xbox uh, One, take a look. There's backward compatible. There's a list. Like if you, if it's on that list, and you put it in your system, you have a what? Xbox One S. I have a One S. Yes. Okay. Well, look it up. You can probably pop it up online. All the compatible games. And a lot of these games, like Mass Effect, that will work on the Xbox One if you put it in the 360. These are, these are all in the Game Pass Ultimate. Oh, they are? Okay. Yeah, yeah some, a lot of them might be. You know, um, the Sonder the Collection from the Game Pass. Oh, okay. Sky, the, the, a lot of the Elder Scrolls are in there. Oh, okay. Um, See, I have, I have Game Pass also. I just. Crisis, the Crisis Collection. Uh huh. Maybe not some of the sports games. Maybe not. What is that? Is that Black Flag? What now? Oh, one of the best Assassin's Creed. Black Flag? Yes. Yeah, yeah. I, I haven't finished it, but it was really different tried, from the other black ones. I've tried getting into Valhalla. And it's now, this one is backwards compatible. Yeah. That one is. You tried to get into Valhalla? Valhalla. Is it not that good? It's... Good, it's just not my game. You ever played that one? No. I that's also on the game pass, so I could download it for free. Yeah, this is this is great. Fallout New Vegas, man. Whenever I get a copy of Fallout New Vegas out, people are like, Oh man, it's Fallout. I'm gonna buy that. But this it's, is uh, this, this is most people's favorite Fallout, I would it's, say. It's Fallout New Vegas three, four, and seventy six. That's the yeah, game pass. I got a couple over here, yes sir. Got hit with the bug. Oh, that's that's not good. That bug didn't like you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yesterday I sold a copy, a good copy of San Andreas. Wow. PlayStation Two. You know. Sometimes, I, sometimes I get them in. Sometimes I swap and I trade with people, yeah. and they say, "Hey, I got a stack here. You trade me for that." I'm like, "Maybe, sure." That works out for everybody. Yeah. I, I used, Thanks, man. I'm here uh, every Sunday. I might have something different next Sunday. I used what to. Uh, I used to have uh, San Andreas for PS2. Until my PS2 overheated and kind of ruined my disc. Oh, it overheated? Yeah. Did, did it mess up? Like it doesn't work after it overheated? It, I, replaced, I replaced the fan in it. So after that, I had lost my copy of San Andreas after that. So you just replaced the fan in it? Yeah. Yeah. How many, uh, you, you saw any desktop computers? I'm looking for maybe like an older desktop computer I do for, that. for a buddy of mine. His computer is like. I have a broken Chromebook. You have a broken Chromebook. He likes uh, desktops. Hey, how you doing, buddy? Well, yeah, I got mostly Xbox One, Xbox 360 games, one PlayStation game there. Watch Dogs 2 is my favorite. What you have? Watch Dogs 2 is really good. Yeah, you know, in that one, you can actually have animals and pets. Like, you can actually, the cops, when they come, they stick the dogs on you. 
and you actually have to wind up shooting dogs. I don't like I don't like shooting dogs. I love dogs. But oh, you can get tasers in there, right? Maybe I could taser the dogs. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you can get tasers. There's things about that, like I'd say Mortal Kombat X and Mortal Kombat. Okay. Thank you. I got a bag for you. Uh, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna get going. Okay, well it's nice talking to you, buddy. Yeah. You take care of yourself. Thank you.